Welcome to Extreme Sandbox. We have a good time out here today. Yes. yes. Sorry, Eric, I couldn't do any. I'll do it. That was Too awful. Uh, so today we are doing our scenario-based team building event. So the way this event breaks out is with the scenario is you got we got two teams. We love doing these events. They're a lot of fun. Uh, Safety is our number one priority out here. So we don't do a ton of these, and because you know most of our stuff, we're in very controlled settings out here where we have areas where we're going to use the equipment, things like that. Uh, we're going to have a scenario later in the day that's going to be out and you're going to be actually using the equipment to accomplish a task as a team. And you're actually going to have people walking on the course, there's different things to do. Our goal today is not just about having fun, we're going to have fun, but it's more about making you guys team build together. We're going to put you, we're going to push you outside your comfort zone, um, put you into a really cool scenario, and hopefully you guys are going to learn from it. So do you have any opening predictions uh, before we start here? Who's going to win? Team My 1 team. or Team 2? Team 2, because I'm on Team 2. Oh, wow. <laughs> so left hand forward, extend those sticks all the way back up. How's it going, dude? Good. My dudes. Dudes. Chris is welcome to Minnesota. We have a little different event today, right? We do. Uh, Chris, make sure that bucket's here. We want those red lines horizontal. Yeah, we got a scenario event today. That's well, exciting. What? That's exciting. I'm excited. Hopefully the rain holds off. Basically, what does a scenario Basically, event entail? Yeah, if you want to dump one there and then uh, whatever, and you drive to the other side, that works too. Uh, scenario basically is they're doing practice rounds right now. We're going to bring the group back together in the garage to do a briefing on the, what the scenario is. They got two teams, and then what they're going to do is we're going to take them to the other side of the hill where we have this scenario set up for them. Probably didn't hear anything on the last part, but that's fine. How are you doing, Chris? Awesome, awesome. Um, Texas home sweet home, but Minnesota uh, is welcoming, and it's uh, so far so good. You're having fun though. I'm having a blast. That, can you play? <laughs> can you pee on the course? Is that a pee on the course? Was that the first one? <laughs> that was, that was actually, that is a first. Hey, good job and on doing a first. And that's the captain, too. Okay, you guys, that was the fun and games. This is where the real work begins. You guys ready to do this scenario? Yeah. Okay, any, no questions so far? We've learned that Gabrielle, when she says she can't drive, she really can't drive. <laughs> I, I want to be on the blooper reel. I gotta give you credit, Gabrielle. You told us. You told me that. I'm in, I'm in. That's she's not now, on. She's now actually ready for the New York road. Exactly. What's the difference? <laughs> and that was painful. And you were Chris's first client in Minnesota here. So I was like, I had to go up to Chris off the bike and go, this isn't normally. <laughs> bulldozer excavator. Essentially what you're trying to do, you each team has a car, you have to move it from one side of the course through a roadway, which is down there where those arrows are, and then place it, build it at your garage. The garage is the X on there, okay? Three, two, one, go! 
Do you feel like Johnny Depp in Pirates of the Caribbean yet? Uh, Indiana Jones, yeah. Come on. Pep tack stands for uh, problem exists between keyboard and, and chair. And chair. <laughs> Is he trying to find the baton? Yes, he is. Do you have faith in him that he will find it? <laughs> yep, eventually. This is, don't sound too convincing. We just have to dig up the whole field, worst <laughs> case. <laughs> Do you have a winner? Yeah. Get everyone together, grab a water. How was it? Woo! Yes, go. Who's the winning team? We are. Well, let's see, safety's number one. You guys are actually both pretty good. Uh, I had a little, there are a few issues we did group later. Uh, we gave that team one for Woo! safety. Woo! I think the thing that pushed us over was team two trying to move a 2,000 pound tire by hand. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Building the garage. We're actually gonna give team two because you mainly got it in there first and you got in there, drove right through it and everything like that. So that's gonna be team two. Moving the vehicle, you were kind of a tie because you both really did the same way. I mean, team one kind of went early, but we kind of called that one a wash. Um, and then the final locating baton and our winning team, team one. <laughs> Gwen with one end. <laughs> Five. <laughs> Alright, one, two, three, read the fing manual! <laughs> <laughs> I'm crushed!